Oh my gosh, 40 uses of 4 seconds of Paralyze! I think we made the fucking correct choice, holy shit! That's fucking good, dude! That is real damn good! Yoink! Delmar, is it o I took everything, Delmar! I did it, pal! I hope you don't fucking mind! Hello, <laughs> guildmate. Let's see, anything, uh... Isn't it uncanny how I did Lenormand move? Can I test it out, Delmar? Can I t do some testing with the staff, maybe? Uh, I think so. It'd be a good fucking idea. We you want to learn there. to fall off a building? Uh... She's the one to talk to. Boom! Delmar, does it work? What's going on? <laughs> Look at Delmar! <laughs> oh, oh my gosh, she's mad as hell. You too! Oh, shit! No, she reflected it onto me! No! <laughs> What's good? Welcome back to Oblivion! Jesus Christ. I'm just here hanging out in none other than the Arcane University, the Mage's Quarters, watching old Mage Apprentice McGillicuddy pacing furiously. Oh, what's gonna happen? Oh my gosh, he's worried about m being late for a test, but little does he know his pacing is getting in the damn way! You idiot! Jesus! Alright, so anyway, in between videos, you know, for a while, we've been on the precipice of a level, as you can see. We are literally one cast of this big perp, uh, from getting to level 6? Level 5? Level 6! So, what I did is I went out and trained up at Rashida. Remember Rashida? She would give us some sort of fantastic armor or training. And you know what? That's exactly what we needed. We needed three of them to get up to, uh five points worth of endurance the most important stat of all so here we go boom there we go nice and we're gonna take a nice little nap here and hopefully we should have five in three things there we go strength speed a little rare to get that nowadays because you know as athletics and acrobatics is moving oh geez anyway and endurance my gosh remember when we were going to try and get luck every level hmm funny how things work out but anyway very important that we get endurance if anything I did a, a little bit of research in this, and uh, luck is actually not super important in Oblivion. Although I do really fucking love luck, it's gotta be said. But uh, the way the formulae work in Oblivion Land... Oh shit, we, we didn't even read the little thing. Eh, it's something, you learned a lot in Cyrodiil, you had some good times, had a few laughs, had a few drinks, shot a few necromancers, you're feeling a little smarter. Bam, there you go, a custom uh, insert there for you for the fantastic level. Oh shit, look at this. He spilt all sorts of shit all over the floor. Maybe that was us when we threw that plate. Also, I grabbed a book from up here. Look, they got all sorts of good books. I think they might have the rare, the real Baron Zaya, all five editions. I don't know. Could be. Oh shit, I thought I had grabbed that book. I thought I had actually grabbed the Life of Uriel Septum. Maybe I didn't? Because that, that was going to be one that I thought, hey, that would be a good one to read one of these days. Especially, you know, all things considered. Yeah, there we go. We're going to read that one at the end if I remember. And if I'm not too fucking hoarse. A horse, a horse, of course, of course, motherfucker. Let's head the hell out of here and go turn in. Oh, whoops. This is this is not the right place at all. This is not the right place. Do they have anything good in here? Any, like, tongs or anything? I got a mandrake root and some red wart flower. I mean, I'll just take all these. Why the hell not? And a nerd root. Yeah, I'll just take all that. Oh, yeah. don't, don't mind if I fucking do. I'll just, uh, I'll just be taking some... Oh, whoops. That was... <laughs> Shit. <laughs> Fuck me. I thought that was just a flower. I wasn't reading it all. Damn it! My gall has gotten the best of me. I've just looted a planter. Alright, here we go. Ugh. Good as new! Boom! Alright, we're gonna turn in this quest, get some sort of fantastic, uh, zapping sword. I need a moment of oh. your time. Well, alright, but please be brief. I have some oh. research I need to tell you. <laughs> it's the same fucking voice actor I've for both of them. I've been thinking about our conversation yesterday. And decided to consult some of the ancient texts. You were right. Yo, look at this guy's everything. fucking haircut. Mm -hmm. That just goes to show you how little we really know. Dude, look at this guy's magic. fucking haircut. And what the and fuck is going on? Is this a bug? Incredible. He has two haircuts. There's more research to be done, of course. But the initial right, right, yeah, research. I'll let you know when I have some more information. <laughs> Look at this shit! We shouldn't keep this guy's this rocking the crown of power and a mohawk! But let them know the complications we face. We'll continue our talk later. Farewell, Magister. May your spells Magister. never falter. Oh my Greetings, gosh. Greetings, Apprentice. 
Jesus Christ. And he looks like, uh, what's his name? The fish man. Ah, oh my gosh. Doug Jones, doesn't he? He looks almost like Doug Jones. Or like Doug Jones' brother. Long well lost brother. Met, Guildmate. All right. Let's go find Raminus Polis. Is that him? No. He would have a marker, right? The, the marker would have turned green. Archmage's Lobby. All right. What's up, Raminus Polis? You back sooner. Oh, shit. I mean, I did dilly-dally a shitload, you know. I did a bunch of training, a whole bunch of stuff. I'm sorry. I'm late for everything, but, uh... Good news is everybody. Well, I mean, bad news Hello, is everybody Peter. got killed. Good news is I killed all the what? killers. Necromancers at the cave. Yeah, yeah, necromancers at the cave. Eleta and Zorasha dead. I can't believe it. I took some of their They've clothes. They've never been so okay? bold before now. Always hiding in the shadows, staying away from the guild. What could have prompted this? I'll need to speak to the council about this. Thank you for relaying the information. I'll tend to your staff and. Your wounds, if necessary. Delmar at the Kiranasium can help you with the staff. See him right away. Oh, we know Delmar. Man, dude, you're right, Raminus Polis. Holy shit. All, first, you like ban necromancy, and then, huh, man, what could have possibly made the necromancers get real fucking pissed and go crazy? I don't know. Definitely wasn't banning necromancy and all that stuff and outlawing it. <laughs> Definitely wasn't that. Definitely wasn't some sort of chain of events going on there. All right. Mage's staff. I mean, of course, realistically, you could probably argue that maybe it was going to happen anyway. All right, Mage's staff. What's now up? Now that you have the wood, speak with Delmar at the Kiranasium. All right, Kiranasium. All right, uh, rumors. The Mage's Guild runs more or less like it always did, but we lost quite a few members when the practice of necromancy was banned. Hmm. Man, does this guy do audiobooks? This guy should do audiobooks. I mean, I don't, I don't really buy audiobooks, but. Soon. He should, or like a podcast or something, man. Hot damn. All right, let's see. The Kiranasium. Are we tracking the correct quest here? Yes, we are. Seems so. All right, let's head on out over here. Man, what was up with that guy's hair, by the way? Man, that was pretty crazy. Hmm. Find all sorts of magical stuff here at the Arcane University. We should have gotten like a double haircut like that. Jeez. Yeah, look at this. How does that guy do that? How does he do it? How does he do the things that he does? All right, let's head on in here, the Chironasium. Get our fantastic enchanted staff by Welcome Mr. To the toilet Paper himself. Thanks, Welcome Delmar. To the Can I help you? Yes, I'd like one frosty staff, please. Uh, let's ask him a rumor. Things first. in the guild have been different since Traven was named Archmage. They're more structured. Right? Okay, yeah, I think we've heard that one exactly. All right, Mage's staff. Ah, oh, yes. This is a big step for you, friend, whether you know it or not. Now you'll need to decide what sort of staff you're looking for. Something that fits you and your abilities. Shall we begin? Oh shit, can we get all sorts of things? Yeah, let's do it, man. Enchanting staves can be a tricky business. Only certain spells will be truly useful to you, so I'll narrow it down some. Let's start with the school. Which appeals most to you? Destruction, illusion, or mysticism? Oh shit, we could get an illusion staff. Oh man! Let's get an illusion staff. Holy shit, fuck the frost. Illusion. There are three options for illusion magic. They are charm, paralyze, and silence. Which would you like? Oh my god, I want paralyze, dude! Well, hang on, let's see what the other options oh. are. All right, then. Your I didn't realize we could do this. All right, mysticism. There are three things I can enchant the staff with. Soul trap, eh. telekinesis, eh. and dispel. Uh. Let's see. Let's start oh. over. Your choice... Yep, 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 yep. What, what do you do for destruction? I'm assuming the big three. Very well. You have three choices for what type of damage you'd like it to do. Fire, frost, or shock. Mm, no thanks. Oh. I want the paralyze. Oh. Your that choices seems so are damn good. destruction... Yep, yep. Illusion. Three yep, paralyze, baby. You'll be able to freeze opponents in their tracks for a short time with this staff. I can begin work now, or we can start over. Oh my god, begin work now! That's what I want! Right. I'll get to work. You come see me tomorrow, and I'll have your staff ready. What? Delmar, why are you telling me like that? Uh, Delmar, is it gonna be in the shape of a penis? Uh, I'm kind of okay with that. Alright, so, gosh, now we just need to wait. Oh my gosh, should we just wait 24 hours to get our sweet paralyzed staff? I sure should think so, holy shit, I want it. Man, that is gonna be so useful! A paralyzed staff. I didn't even. It didn't even dawn on me that they might do more than destruction. Holy wackadoo! The great thing about paralyze in Oblivion Land compared to Morrowind Land 
is that in Morrowind Land, it literally just freezes your character, and no physics is enacted. But in Oblivion Land, well, hot damn, they're making a little use of the physics going on. They just topple on over. And what do you know, Joe? A one-second paralyze is actually aces. <laughs> I've been watching a lot of Fargo. So if you've seen Fargo, you know about aces. <laughs> Shit. The, the show. First season of the show. I haven't started on other seasons. No spoilers! No spoilers! All right. Let's head on inside to and the claim our thing. But yeah, it, it knocks them down and they have to get up and oh my gosh, it gives you so much more time than just one second because of their recovery. Which is also kind of why, you know, the Fusro Da in uh, Skyrim Land is so fucking here good too. Associate came to aid okay, himself. yeah, we've heard about this. Mr. Welcome toilet Paper, to Mr. Chiromasia. Toilet Paper. Can I help you? Give me my staff! I want my magical staff, Delmar. Please. Yes, it's all finished. It's in that cupboard back in the corner. I hope it serves you well. Oh, thanks, Delmar. All right. Tell me another rumor? The Mage's Guild runs more or less like it always did. All right, we've heard about all this shit. All right, see you, Delmar. Please Thanks. Apprentice. Let's see, in the cupboard, huh? The cupboard of magic. Wow, there's a lot of stuff in here. Oh, my gosh. What? Delmar, can I, can I take all of this, too? Holy shit. Oh, my gosh. 40 uses of four seconds of Paralyze. I think we made the fucking correct choice. Holy shit. That's fucking good, dude. That is real damn good. Yoink. Delmar, is it o I took everything, Delmar. I did it, pal. I hope you don't fucking mind. Hello, <laughs> guildmate. Let's see, anything, uh... Isn't it uncanny how I did Lenorman move? Can I test it out, Delmar? Can I t do some testing with the staff, maybe? Uh, I think so. It'd be a good fucking idea. We you want to learn there. to fall off a building? Uh... She's the one to talk to. Boom. Delmar, does it work? What's going on? <laughs> Look at Delmar. <laughs> Oh, oh my gosh, she's mad as hell. You too! Oh shit! No, she reflected it onto me! No! <laughs> of course. Of course. Of course it would happen. Of course. She would reflect it back at me. What was I thinking? Of course she would do that. Fuck me. We can't even have fun. Good lord, the fun is ruined. Can you believe that shit? Jesus Christ. What the fuck? These mages! Fuck them! Jesus! I'm no mage at heart! Oh, I'm a- I'm a buccaneer! I'm a buccaneer! Jeez, jeez, jeez. That's- that's what buccaneers love to say. Jeez, a whole lot. I notice I've been saying jeez Hello, a whole lot more me. since I started watching Fargo 2. Really recommend it. Holy shit. Billy Bob Thornton? Weird name. Haven't seen him in most of his good things, like Sling Blade or whatever the hell. I haven't seen that, although he's supposed to be really good in that. But holy shit, he's killer in Fargo. He's killer in it. Uh, other things I've seen him in are just like mostly garbage, like fucking Bad Santa that somehow manages to still come on broadcast television around uh, Christmassy time, huh? <laughs> Jesus. All right, so we've gotten the quest completed for the Mages Guild. Now we have more Mages Guild quests that we could do, but we already have access to everything that we want to do. So we're gonna go with the Thieves Guild for now. We'll come back to the Mages Guild after we get some things in motion. What we want to do, we've laid out this plan before. We want to get Thieves Guild, that way we can have a reliable fence with a lot of quatloos, that way we can make some money. Because, eh, we're a buccaneer, we're a sneak thief, we like to steal shit, we love to sell it off, love to make the big ones. So, that's exactly what we're gonna do. I was giving, given a mysterious note by a mysterious Dark Elf. It offers great wealth and less jail time. Maybe I should check it out. I have to wait until midnight and then go to the Garden of Dareloth. Oh my gosh, remember that? Remember when we got arrested in out ah, by Glarthier land? We got met by a shitload of different people. Newest edition. This humble battle mage bids you welcome. Oh, I'm not that new, pal, but thanks nonetheless. Oh shit, I thought I'd bound my thing to uh Oh, be yeah, cuz we got Yeah, okay. <laughs> right. Okay, there we go. <laughs> yeah. Wow, what a fucking thing to have occurred. Jeez. All right. Man, I thought we were going to have another fantastic fun New Vegas time like when I learned the paralyzing palm attack. The fucking uh, Vulcan nerve pinch in New Vegas, and we just used it and were able to get away with it. Huh. People in uh, Oblivion Land, uh, not so fucking lenient on the crime, as it turns out. Not so fucking lenient at all. Should we, uh, yeah, we're gonna walk there. We're gonna walk there and take in some uh, some sights, you know? I enjoyed uh, the, the long route, as has Speak. been. Oh, Speak. Hieronymus Lex, you sick son of a bitch, as if the game knew. Oh, what I was up to. <laughs> I'm 
sorry. I don't know what got into me. I've been drinking a little bit of coffee, you know. It gets me. It gets me. It gets my goat. What can I say? Jeez, oh, Pete. Now, if I remember correctly, the path to unlocking the theme skilled fence is actually pretty damn easy and quick. Because I want to say that's exactly what I've done in the past. I've just gotten the uh, Thieves Guild situation going good and just never fucking did the rest of their quests. Alright, heading on out here, City Isle, going on over to a nice little place. Jeez. Oh, uh, look at this. <laughs> it's like its own little Imperial City right here. It's a tiny version for little, little people. Little wood elves hang out here. Oh my gosh. <laughs> That's, that's terrible. That's a terrible thing to say. <laughs> Jeez. Ah, oh, but look. The fucking beautiful-ass boats. Oh my gosh. I love boat. Wow, this boat just has a fucking house on it. Jesus Christ. Oh my god, I want that boat for damn sure. Holy shit. Hopefully the... The, the Burrow Cove of uh, piracy has a fantastic boat as well. Oh, I'm excited. I'm excited as hell just thinking about it. All right, let's see. Where do we head to? Over this way. All right, fair enough. Oh, and look who it is. A wanted poster for none other Don't than... Don't be the last to read today's Black Horse Courier. Oh, I won't. Here, give it to Have me. Have a copy what? of the Black oh. Horse Courier. It's the only way to get the real news. Feature story on the Gray Fox. Oh, I think I may have already read this one, but thanks, Lenaris Cavinchel. Here's a copy of the Black Horse Courier. <laughs> Shit. Identity of the Gray Fox. Wow, Courier. already? They revealed him? Okay. Sorry. What else is new? Only one cop. Oh, I I feel like you. I just got two of them though, Cavinchel. Tell me about the city. Castive says he works. Ha! Flies land on him. He's too lazy to brush them off. I'm sick of taking abuse for him, even if he is my brother. Wow. Jeez. Oh my gosh. So fucking angry. Oh my gosh. You better watch out. In a place like this, you're bound to get fucking murdered, Cavinchel. All right. You <laughs> yeah. You too. You're bound to get murdered. Let's see. Did we already read all of his dumb stuff that he gave us? Let's see. The Gray Fox, man or myth? Did we read about this? Hmm. Let's see. I believe we did read about the, uh... Let's see. Is a so-called Thieves Guild master... Masterminding all the thefts in the Imperial City? Captain Hieronymus Lex of the Imperial Watch seems to think so. When asked about the Thieves Guild and its mythical leader, the Gray Fox, the captain was quite empathetic. Emp emphatic. The This one man is responsible for all crime in the city. The energetic and tenacious Captain Lex has therefore devoted himself to apprehending this masked menace. When questioned on the subject, Ad Ademus Felida, Legion Commander and Captain Lex's immediate superior, had the following response. Ridiculous. The Gray Fox is just a fairy tale. There is no such thing as a thieves' guild, and there never has been. Stories of an unstoppable thief called the Gray Fox have been circulating around the Imperial City for centuries. The stories claim he can turn invisible at will, shrink himself down to the size of a mouse, turn to mist and seep under locked doors, and perform any number of truly unbelievable feats. If even half of these stories are true, Captain Lex will have his hands full capturing the Gray Fox. Oh my gosh, read just like the fucking local news. Holy shit, terrible. All right, in this one, we have, uh, wait, what the fuck? Vlanaris Cavinchel recently admitted to being the notorious thief, the Gray Fox. We read this one, remember? Yeah, he he said that he was the reincarnation of Tiber Septum, the love child of Lord Standar, and a were shark, and the mother of Hieronymus Lex. And he just gave us this. Vlanaris Cavinchel? What? Are you? <laughs> what is up, man? Sorry. Only one copy of the Black Horse Courier per customer. What the fuck? Oh, this is a weird confluence of events. Oh, my gosh. Well, see you, Cavinchel. We're out. Peace. All right, we're going on over here to this uh, little, oh, little nice fishing area. Some little love shacks out here. Little, little nice love shacks. A nice scenic area. Oh, and who is this? Oh, what is this? An abandoned shack. Well, that's not very strange at all. Let's hear it. Hillard the Outlaw. Wow. 
You should probably change your last name or else, geez, and Pete, they're going to be after you. the outlaw because I'm on the lam. <laughs> because I'm on the lam. You better watch out. I'm Hillard. I'm the fucking outlaw. You better watch out. I'm going to pick your pockets and rob you, pal. <laughs> Tell me about the Imperial City, you dashing outlaw. Oh, my gosh. What a criminal man. Ooh, he's so dashing and roguish. And, oh, my gosh. It gets me all in a tiffy. I helped build Raven Rock. What? Had a bad run in with the law, so here I am. Pretty soon I'll head out for the Imperial Reserve. Try my luck there. No shit! No way, is he. Was he in the uh, Blood Moon expansion? Oh my god! He helped build Raven Rock! Holy shit! Alright, damn Hilla the Lap. Farewell. Hilla, you're fucking alright by me. You uh, really are out on the land. Damn, dude. Meth. Meth. Methredhell's house. Okay. Jeez. <laughs> <laughs> Let's see, what do we have here? Anything good? Wow, repair him. Don't mind if I do. Gotta be on the lookout for them tongs. Oh, look, it's Covincial Shack. Should we? Should we go in here? I mean, Covincial is the Gray Fox after all, right? <laughs> Let's go inside and check on Covincial. Shit, but Hilla the Outlaw. Will he snitch on a fellow outlaw? Let's see. Let's go in here and check on Covincial shit. Eventual, you damn idiot. You shouldn't have revealed that you were actually the gray fucking fox. Now everybody's on your fucking case, including Lyle the Buccaneer who can't pick a lock for shit. Jesus Christ, all my skills have gone to shit. Drank one cup of coffee and look, I'm too on edge to pick a lock. Jesus! There we go. Okay, slow and steady, slow and steady. Oh, calm the nerves, calm the nerves. The coffee is... Oh, it's too much. The power is too overwhelming. Shit! There we go. Okay, that's the one we gotta wait for. There we go. Alright, we can do it. Oh! I'm too damn excited. It is not conducive to this. Oh my god. Oh my god, okay. We just gotta relax. There we go, like that, like that. Like a leaf on the wing, baby. Oh! Come on. Oh, that's another one. Yes! Oh, I knew we had it in us. Oh my gosh. Whoa. Thank God. Convincial, I'm here in your secret house. Stealing all- Oh my gosh, double down, baby. Togs and calipers. It was worth it, I think. Holy shit. Whole bunch of clothes here, a broom. Oh my gosh, the gray fox is really not living it up big time at all. Let's see, some gold, yarn. Let's see, pewter pitcher, tan cup, flour. Should we take some flour, get some flour power? No thanks. Look, he's got some little sacks hidden around here. A little sack with a, some pants in them. And a shirt. Okay. Wow, Covincial. Jeez, I'm not sure if this guy is the Gray Fox at all. Huh. I could have sworn he was telling the complete truth in his uh, missive there. But you know what? Jeez, maybe he was full of shit. Let's see. Did what's-his-name catch us? Let's check here real quick. See if we got tattletailed on. Nope. We are A-OK. -okay. All right, fantastic. Oh, shit. What? This barrel has a lock on it. Mir- Uh, Myvrena Arano's house. Shit, should we pick her barrel? That seems pretty damn suspicious that there's a lock on her barrel. Let's see here. Look at me, fucking trying to do picks when I should not be. I really should not be. Oh, maybe I should. <laughs> oh, she's only got tongs and a little bit of gold in there. All right, anything inside of her house? Man, we're just robbing all of the uh, poor folks living out here. Oh my god, look at this guy. He's oh. ready to fucking jam. Oh. Uzal Grow Grulam. No, I wanted to talk, Uzal. Shit. Look, guy to Bruma. Aren't you an ugly one? <laughs> wow, okay. See ya, you? you ass. Huh? I'm glad I took your shit. What's up, Uzal? What were you doing in there? Uzal Grow Grulam. I'm courting Mavrina Arano, so stay away from her. I got matrimony on my mind. <laughs> All right, pal. Sure thing. Oh, man. Tell me a rumor. Gorl Groshug always seems at ease in light armor. He moves well in it. Oh. oh man, I thought you were courting what's-her-name in there, but okay. I guess you have your eyes on two. All right, tell me uh, about the city. Hard to find an orc girl in this city like Uma Gramarad. Smart, tough, got a good trade. Nice looking, too. So I gotta make my intentions clear. What the fuck? Uzal Gro Grulam, how many people are you trying to marry here? What What the hell is going on, man? <laughs> Jesus. <Enough talk. laughs> man, fucking 
Uzal Grogulam, a big proponent of polygamy, apparently. <laughs> Jesus Christ. All right, let's see. What do we have here? A shack for sale. Oh, yes, that's the one that we can buy. Oh, we need to save up and buy this beautiful little love shack. How much money do we have? Not nearly enough. We've spent it all on stupid shit. Frankly, that's exactly what we've done. Armand Christophe's house? I think that's the guy. I want to say that's the guy. I suppose we should all be working. Anything here? Some shears and some suspender shirts. Let's the see. Elder Council will take care oh, nope. Oh, is this the meeting spot? Let's see. Oh, I think it's I'll over see. this way, if I remember. Yeah, this looks familiar. This rings a bell. All right. Well, let's hide in these fucking bushes. Like a good thief, huh? Boom. There we go. Let's see. When do we have to wait? Like midnight or like 10 o'clock or something like that? Let's see. Maybe I should check it out. I have to wait until midnight. Okay. Go to the Garden of Darelock. All right. Quick save. Boom. There we go. Let's see. Let's do... Should we do a little bit past midnight? That's probably fine. Let's go with that. Just uh, half an hour past midnight. The game will forgive us. Oh, please. The Nine Divines. Look, I pray up to you. Stendar. Oh, jeez. Come on, man. Cut me some slack. All right. Let's see what we got. Is old what's-his-butt out here? Oh, yes, he is. Surprise! I was in the bushes all along! That's right, you idiots! <laughs> Sign me up, baby! I'm a thief! Ooh, Armand does not look pleased at fucking all. <laughs> Do I know you? Yeah, I'm the newest member of the Thieves' Guild. Wink! How about that? Oh my gosh, I'm applying to a job. <laughs> let's see. Uh, let's ask him about all of this, except for the profit. He's just a name on a wanted poster. I don't trust you enough to say more than that. <laughs> okay, wow. Jeez, I feel like by saying that, you've, you've told me a little something something. Tell me about the city. A little tip. People who ask a lot of questions around here tend not to be very popular. Oh my gosh, Armand. All right, jeez, he really did not like the bush maneuver. All right, here, I got a mysterious note, though. Did you know? I'm a criminal. Ah, yes. Another ah, scoundrel yes. who served time in an imperial jail. <laughs> the Gray Fox is offering you a chance to join the Thieves' Guild. I can't ever fucking hear someone say, ah, yes, and not think of fucking old Egrala, <laughs> for fuck's sake. Ah, yes, we've been expecting you, for fuck's sake. All right, uh, let's see. I would like to join the Thieves' Guild. Hell yeah, man. Look, he's pleased now. Everyone is here. Let's begin. Each of you is seeking membership in the Thieves' Guild. Hmm. The Thieves' Guild is not a myth. We are followers of the Grey Fox, and I am his doyen. Merely He's by doing. finding me, you have passed the first test. It's unusual for us to have <laughs> Look at him. potential recruits <laughs> at the same time. Rather than the normal test. Man, he's pretty soft spoken. To make this a contest. That's not fair. Methrodel, you know the rules. However, for Amuse and the newcomer, let me state them clearly. Whoever brings me the diary of Amantius Electus without killing him. Invited into the guild. Ha! I'll have it before sunrise. Somewhere in the Imperial City, the beggars will help you locate it for a price. I can sell you lockpicks if you need them. Hmm. One more thing. You cannot kill each other during this trial. We may be thieves, but we're not murderers. Oh yeah, murder. <laughs> I'm so above murder. I spoke with Armand Christophe, who is a member of the Thieves Guild. He offered me a chance to join the guild, but I have to compete against two other thieves, Methred Hell and Amuse. Whichever one of us steals Amantius Electus's diary first will be inducted into the Thieves' Guild. It's somewhere in the Imperial City. He told me that the beggars might be able to tell me where to find it. Hmm. All right. Maybe he lives in the Elven Gardens district. Oh, maybe he does, Amuse. You want to team up, Amuse, and I'll do like a... We can do like a um, a Hunger Games situation, Amuse. Jeez, how about that? Can I be Katniss? Oh my gosh, I want to be the sexy lady. Hell yes. Let's see. Where are we headed? Oh, I think the, the quest marker thing is just, yeah, report back to what's-his-butt. All right, where's a beggar? Are you a beggar? No, you're not. Wow, look at all these Good to fucking see you. pirates Good just to hanging see out here. You. I wonder if they're aware that pirates are actually, uh, you know, usually criminals. Someone someone just goes around, I'm a pirate! I like to rob and pillage people on the high seas and sometimes murder them and capture them and 
do all sorts of terrible things, hold them for ransom, sell them into slavery. I don't know. What kind of pirate do you think I am? A wink? <laughs> Jeez. All right. We're heading on up in here. I wonder if it's faster for us to fast travel or if it actually takes more time uh, to fast travel than it would to just walk. I do not know. I do not freaking know. Good Lord. I wonder if we'll be able to pull off this heist, honestly. Look, I feel like we're actually making some good time here, frankly. Let's see. Oh, look, our thing has changed. Oh, look at that. Hey, look, we actually have a marker right now. Huh. All right, we'll go over here and talk to some people. Let's see, are we actually tracking the right quest? May the best thief win. Okay. Man, what happens if I lose? Do I have to come back again on, a on another night? Because my sneak skill ain't that high. It really ain't that high. All right, let's see. Oh, this must be to talk to some sort of beggar back here, perhaps? Oh, hello. Hello, hello, hello. Oh, look who it is. Ragbag Buntara. What's up, Ragbag? I'm so hungry. Here, take a whole bunch of shit. Let's see. Have a coin, beggar. Thank you, kind sir. All right, now tell me a secret. I gave you some coin to spill the beans. I've heard of him. I've What's he worth to you? What's he worth to you? I'm short of corn. Uh, here, of corn. Here's five corn. You are most generous. He lives in the temple district on the far east side. He's an early riser. Usually up by sunrise. Oh my gosh, okay. Well, <laughs> easy. We'll be able to find him no problem. Let's see, can we ask about some other stuff? Anything for you. He lives in the temple district on the far east side. Okay, okay, thanks. Blessings of our Oh, let's head on out there. Holy shit. Let's see, we should also take off our shoes. That way we're a little bit better at sneaking, huh? Yeah. Let's see. Should we just go around barefoot? No, we'll wait until we go there. Because, good God, going around barefoot? Oh, my gosh. I am not a fan of that. I always feel so fucking vulnerable being barefoot. Oh my gosh, I remember way back when in elementary school, they would they would say like, oh yeah, you can take your shoes off here for PE. I was like, why the fuck would I do that when not everyone is going to take their shoes off? Like, if I'm here jamming out trying to do some shit here in the old physical education course, well, holy shit, I don't want to be the one who gets their toes stepped on, literally. All right, let's see. Let's whip off our steel boots. Boom, there we go. And quick save here. Nice, and do a little bit of picking. Oh my gosh, look, we primed ourselves for this earlier. Oh my gosh, and we have primed ourselves for failure. <laughs> ah, fantastic! Oh, great. Now hopefully... <gasps> oh my god, the asshole. Not today! Let's see. <laughs> look, we're just in fucking time! I've beaten Mithridel and Amuse to Amantius Electus's diary. Now to get back to Armand in the Garden of Daryloth. I'll have to wait until midnight when he is there. <laughs> wait, she's in here already! <laughs> Eat a dick, you idiot! That's right! The Buccaneer Lyle strikes again! Get the fuck out of here! Stay out of my territory! Stay out of my territory! <laughs> Jesus Christ! <laughs> oh my god! Oh, Jesus! We may not have 100 luck, but it feels like we do! Oh my gosh, let's go in his basement too. Jesus, this poor guy, let's just steal everything from him if we can. If we even can. <laughs> Jesus Christ, how did we manage it? Man, that is so fucking lucky. Jesus, this is not lucky. There we go, Woo! Oh my gosh, great. Let's see, anything else down in here? Oh my gosh, hopefully he doesn't- Oh my god, what the fuck? He has a murder dungeon! What the fuck? Oh no! What is all of this? What's he doing with his plants? He's feeding them his own fucking blood? What the fuck is why with the Oh no! Oh no! This guy's fucked up! What the hell? Oh this ain't good, dude! Why's he got all this shit going on? <gasps> Bone meal? Is this guy some kind of fucking necromantic overlord? Oh no, blacksmith's pants. Oh, that's a real bad sign too. Even worse than the blood. <laughs> Jeez. Man, what the fuck is going on here? That seems real bad. Can we even go inside these sewers here? Maybe we should. Oh my god, maybe he's made a deal with the gobos. Oh my gosh. Old Electus. The, the flower guy, the florist. Oh my gosh, he's a florist and a murderer. And a gobo dealer. Let's see if we can't get inside and get up to no damn good. Let's see. Oh, that would have been a good one to do. There we go. Let's see. 
Come on, I have the power. Oh shit, I don't have the power. There we go. Whew. Oh, there we go. One more. Ah, oh, aces. Oh shit. Already the the ambient music has changed. Oh my gosh, his dark fucking lair. Oh shit, it's a gobble god. Gobble god no more. Haha, <laughs> time to use our new fucking ass kicking machine. Boom! Eat a shit dick. Bam! You monkey man, I'll slay you with a sword. Boom, there we go. Dope as hell. Come on, show me what you got. Boom! Oh man, you can't do shit. Ugh, man, we're pretty fucking powerful now. Look at us taking hits like nobody's been business. There we go, come on, Gabo. You wanna jam? Oh, gotcha. Look, he's got a friend in there as well. Oh my gosh, we're really down here, huh? What is this guy up to? I feel like this guy is really making deals with Gabos. He's a Gabo dealer for damn sure. Let's see. Hey, what's up, dude? Hey, hey, how's it going? Uh, you wanna fucking go? Boom! Say hello to my wizard staff! Bam! Uh, ah! Ha ha! Yes! Yes! Feel the wrath of 500 suns burning! Wow, his claws are powerful. Boom, boom. Not as powerful as my gigantic sword, though. <laughs> Excellent. Let's see, some drain luck, a lockpick, some other dumb shit. We'll take the arrows, though. <laughs> Why the hell not? All right, let's quick save here and rest up. Hey, you know, it might be kind of bad if we try and uh, get out of this guy's house when he's uh, awake. You know, just thinking. You know, he's an early riser. What if he comes down here? What if he fucking comes down here? Hmm. What if this is actually a bad thing and it gets us expelled from the guild? Oh, jeez. Oh, no. Just another day in the fucking life, huh? All right. What else do we have down here? Anything good? It doesn't look like it. There's a little lever here. Looks like it's going to open the floodgate. Oh, look at that. Is it doing anything? Oh, yes, it is. Oh, my goodness. Let's go in for a poop swim, baby. I want that poop. Rub it on top of me, there's a poop crab down here, having a jam, and so am I, gonna slash it with my big swad. Boom! Oh yeah! Look at that crab, look, I didn't even need to use my paralysis staff on you. Look, do you have any good shit on you? <laughs> oh yeah, you actually did. Crab meat, and uh, we'll leave the crab meat, that shit is unnaturally heavy, isn't it? A battered crate? Let's see, anything else over here? Over yonder? Anything over yonder? No, I don't think so. I think there's absolutely fucking nothing. Fair enough, dude. Let's quick save. Let's see. Oh, shit. What is in there? Is that like a sacrificial altar? I don't know. We'll go in there in a minute, but for now, let's grab some lettuce. <laughs> All right. Let's see. Oh, my God. There's dead people here, dude. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. It's a goblin. Goblin. It's a goblin. It's a goblin lord. Uh, yeah, there we go. Uh, power strike. Uh, uh, oh, shit. This one has some strength. Boom. There we go. Uh, just slice him up a whole shitload. Jesus. Can we actually take this guy on? Let's see. Oh, my God. Can we soul trap a gabo? Are they considered soul trappable? I think so. Jeez. There you go. Take some of this. Oh, sh ah. sugar. All right. We're, we're not playing fair now. We are not playing fair. All right. Boom. There you go. Take it right up your ass. Boom. 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 Oh, shit. Here we go again. Another one. Boom. There we go. Fantastic. I can do it all day, baby. Here we go. Another one. Boom. <laughs> Oh, man, this is great. I love this step. We'll have to recast our shit, though. Look. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. It's quick save in case he does, like, a lunging lunge. A lunging lunge! Also, Scampy, get in on this. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. <laughs> shit! Oh, man, we got too damn cocky. We pulled out the Scampy at a bad time. A bad time and a bad place. Whoop! <laughs> Not today, Junior! Oh, shit. Whoops, accidentally opened that, meant a quick save. Because, you know, this is a great opportunity to do so. Oh, here we go. Nice. 
get you with your soul. Stealing your soul. Boom, 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 boom. Scampy, you didn't do that much here this time. It's gotta be said. But hey, I still respect you. I still love you. Is he still soul trap mode? Yeah, I think so. Yep, he's definitely big perp. Oh, not anymore. All right, let's do it again. This all be the last one. And bam. Oh shit, we're out of juice. Let's juice up a little bit. Let's see. I want this Gabo soul. Look, we're not even wearing our shoes anymore. I forgot about that. Let's see. Let's get a weak potion of sorcery. We don't have that much mana at the moment. There we go. Pull this sucker out. Boom. There we go. Got your soul, you Gabo bastard. Boom. Let's see. What do you have? Nothing. Ah, jeez. Can we take his weapon? No, there are enemies nearby. Preventing us from resting up. Okay, okay. Let's come on over here. Shit. They are still nearby as hell. Okay, that's fine. Let's see. Let's actually repair our stuff up and not forget to put our boots on. There we go. And repair hammer. Where are you? Look, we got 13 of these freaking things. There we are. Excellent. And where'd your weapon go? Does it not float? I guess not. Let's see. Oh, I can hear it down there somewhere. I want that weapon, you gobbo. Ah, oh, shit. I can't see it for shit. Oh, there we go. Oh, wow. There's dead people down here. Oh, man. That's scary. Wow. Oh, there's a steel mace. All right. Dope. Let's repair it up as well. Get a little bit of XP. Mmm. Sweet and juicy. All right. Let's see. Let's haul ass back here and rest up, huh? Let's... Oh, gosh. No wonder. It's a crab, Yalan. A secret water aqueous crab. There we go. Slaying it like the beast that it is. Ho ho. Any gold on you? Nope. All right, can we rest up now? No, we cannot. Gosh, you don't think they got respawns already? Holy shit, could you imagine that? Already some respawns down here? Man, maybe old, old Grimjaw himself is down here. Ready to give us what for. Good lord. Could you imagine that shit? Oh my god, not good. Not a good one. All right. Oh, let's see. Who the hell else is down here? Anybody? There's definitely at least some more gobos, right? There's gotta be a gobbo. Or two. Or five. Uh, jumping on up here. There we go. Good and great. Let's see. What all is up in here? Oh, there's a guy in here for sure. Can you hear it? The drums of war. Oh, look at all these. Man, there's like six people down there. Just right on our feet. They were eating some lettuce. Oh, look who it is. It's a bunch of little crabulons. All right, we can fuck with them. Boom. There you go. Nice. Oh, easy. Man, forgot how good the uh, long weapons are. Jeez, especially when the enemies are having some poor time pathing. <laughs> look at this. All right, a whole bunch of shit. Look, we can activate this. What do you think this does? Does this open up some sort of secret? Perhaps. It's quick save. Maybe it's closing behind the path right behind us. What does this do? Oh, it's opened remotely. Huh, so that's not one we can actually pop open, is it? Okay, fair enough. Uh, can we jump? Oh, yeah, we made it. Oh, look, did that open up? No, I think that's just a little poop shoot. All right, we're quick saving. I'm a little scared. I'm a little worried about what horrific things we'll find. Look, Southwest Tunnel. Jeez, where the hell are we going? Look, a big-ass door. And a big-ass crab as well. Look, this one is opened up. Man, we're really stuck in the sewers now for damn sure, aren't we? Alright, that's fine though. We've got all sorts of supplies. We're ready to jam down here in the sewers. Got some calipers. Oh, the journey was worth it after all. Alright. Look out, crab. Look! My sword is so powerful and long. Oh, you're no match. There we go. Oh, give me that crab blood. Oh, yeah, I'll make an ancient witch's brew from your crab blood, crab. Let's see. Anything we can do down there? No, I don't think so. All right. Who the hell's over here? Is this another one that's, uh... Oh, Talos Plaza Sewers. Man, the sewers run everywhere, don't they? They're like some real-ass sewers. Huh. Okay. Oh, well, let's see what we got. Let's see. Anything in this? Uh, can we, uh, perhaps, uh, woot and loot? No, we cannot. Okay. Oh, shit. Oh, God. Whew. Oh, I thought we were trapped. My life was flashing before my eyes. All right. Huh. Doing a nice jump. Let's see, let's quick save. 
Should we check out uh, the rest of this little area? I think we should. I think we absolutely freaking should. Let's see. Oh, man, this is a big one. This is a big freaking one. All right, let's just slay these dudes. Look, another crab up ahead. Do you see it? Just barely nudging its way out from the water. Hmm. All right, let's see. Where's this go? Talos Plaza? Yep. All right, where's that one go? Let us see. We need another way out of here. Temple sewers? Okay. Let's quick save again. Temple sewers. There might be something down in there. Forgot. Some of these sewers have some good shit, if I remember correctly. But this one just seems to be full of crabs. Some sort of, like, crab meeting zone. Ugh, gosh, could you imagine going down here to eat crabs? I bet someone must be down here killing crabs and selling off their meat. Jesus Christ, doing a real... <laughs> real fucking Frank and Charlie situation, huh? Let's see. Ugh, there we go. Nice. Getting them with the big hits. There we go. Man, crabs ain't nothing now, are they? Wow, look, our blade has even leveled up. Excellent. All right. Let's see, what all else can we look for down here? Can we scrounge around for any woot loots? Nope. We'll just have to take the gigantic chest and be happy with that. Oh, look, it's got a lock on it. Okay. The crabs must have uh, put a padlock on this after too many damn adventurers came down here looking for their crab treasures. There we go. Great. Oh shit, a gold nugget! Wow! Is that where gold comes from? Crabs? Oh my gosh. It must just be like clams. Clams and oysters and stuff, they make pearls and crabs. Well, after a crab merges with a black hole, it becomes super dense and has the gravitational pull of an old man's asshole. And what do you know, Joe? Bam, out pops a little bit of gold. Genius. Brilliant. God, nature is beautiful, isn't it? Whew, holy shit. All right, we're at the temple area. Perhaps we can come on out of here, like up ahead here. Yeah, let's give this a spin. Is there a freaking big old gabo around here? Is that a gobble I'm at war with? Or is it that crab right there that's sort of peeking through? I think it's a... I think it's just a crab war. Oh, look, we popped that open. All right, good. Let's see. Any gobbles around here? No? Looks like it's just a crab land. Boom. Ugh, let's just jump down here into the poop. Oh, man, this place probably smells... Oh, this probably smells like shit, doesn't it? It probably smells like shit. Ah, oh, spoon. <laughs> this crab was trying to eat some shit. Scooping it right up into its little maw. Oh, kind of cute. But also disgusting, because ultimately the crab is eating shit. Alright. Where is this other crab at? We saw it. But now it has disappeared. It's a stealth crab. There it is. Look. They really have trouble with the stairs. It's like Robocop all over again. Jeez. Boom. There we go. Oh, it's still alive. Jumping Jehoshaphat. Alright. Let's repair this sucker up again. There we go. Man. Really, uh, wears up down real damn fast, doesn't it? Jeez, the crab shells. They're kit chitness, kitness, kiteness. There we go, kiteness. <laughs> Backing and everything. It's, oh, it's, it makes it rough. Real rough to fight them. Good lord. Who knows how they all took down the, uh, emperor crab of yore. Oh my gosh. Perhaps it was magic that they did it with. <laughs> Perhaps it was just wizard's magic. Hmm, my gosh. Wizard's magic. An excellent excuse for anything and everything. Oh my gosh, what a great time. Look, is this one the, the one that we had opened earlier? Let's check our map. Were we in the temp- Oh, look! It may have been! I don't know. No, I don't think so. Let's see. Yeah, we came from in there. Okay, yeah, this is this is fresh area, huh? Alright, fair enough. Man, good thing the map is actually not god-awful in here. Yeah, thank goodness for that. Very imperative. Alright, let's see. I'm surprised we haven't encountered any more gobos, and honestly, that puts me a little bit on edge. It's gotta be said. We are lost as hell down here, by the way. Oh my gosh. Jeez. I mean, this, saying that, that looks like a way out right there. Man! A lunging rat! Wow, three shot him. Holy shit, we're getting good as hell, aren't we? Alright, is this a way out? Oh, it is! Denari Am Amnes' basement. Wow, her basement leads right into a poop hole. Gosh. Could you imagine if you had a basement that led directly into the sewers? Not even like a little manhole cover, but just like a trap door. Man, I would go down there and do all sorts of weird shit. I'd like start eating cookies and like baking brownies and like, you know, jacking off in the middle of the night. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Jesus Christ. All right, let's get the hell out of here. Gosh. Or should we, should we do some more thorough exploration? Maybe we should. Let's actually explore just a little bit. Let's clear out this map before we get the hell out. 
Because look, we have our solution. It's marked on our map. Uh, her basement will pop on out there and just pretend like, oh my gosh, I'm working the sewer shift, ma'am. I'm not actually a sneak thief at freaking all. I'm just here doing some work. Oh, jeez. Dirty jobs, right? Somebody call up Mike Rowe. Get him to report on this. Jeez, I come down here thinking I'm just going to be shoveling up poop. But oh my gosh, I have to fight the mud crab uh, army, the mud crab militia, the rat armada. Oh my gosh, look, this one actually has a lock on it. And I also have to do a bunch of lock picking because I forgot my keys at home. Let's see. There we go. Nice. Look at that. We're, we're getting back into the groove of things. Oh shit, is this one dead? No, it's not. Come on, rat. I know what you're up to. No? Okay. Oh. Jeez. There we go. Three shot him. Boom. Let's see. Anything else good around here? Let's see. What do you got? Rat meat? Eh, we'll take it. Why the hell not? Look, we should be taking all these meats. All these sweet meats. Look, another doorway. Look at that. Some secret shit up there. If only we had our Mario Time Super Jump from Morrowind. Be no damn problem. Look at that. Another tunnel to another land. Look, does this link back up to the... Yeah, okay. So that's the other way. Alright, fair enough. Man, these sewers are humongous. And you know what I always say? I hate sewers. Holy shit, sewers are the most god-awful level ever known to man. Look, at least we found a secret chest. Now that, I'm alright with. Boom, got him, easy. Look, oh, a silver arrow. Oh, now we can slay a vamp, for damn sure. Or is it a wolf? Or perhaps both? I don't know. A torch, and a shirt. Man, someone comes down here to stow away their shirt at night. Oh my gosh. Like, why do you smell like shit all the time? Oh, I forgot I put the shirt down in the poop hole. Forgot all about it. Jeez. Oh my gosh. Where the hell does this come out at? Is this a dead end? It looks like it, doesn't it? Is there actually a Krabulon down here? I don't think so. What is this? Oh, it's a chest. Well, hot damn. Look at that. Almost missed it. If not for the three giveaway uh, bars of iron or whatever you would call that. The, uh... What do you call it? A reinforcement? I don't know. Wow, two calipers! Oh my gosh! It must be my fucking birthday! In the sewers, found two calipers in a stupid chest! In a stupid crate! Holy shit! Ring back and call up uh, Armand! Tell him, holy shit, sign me up to the Thieves Guild! Master Thief over here! Combing the fucking sewers for garbage! Jeez! Alright. Let's get the hell out of here. Let's finally go up inside of her basement and say hello! Oh my gosh! She'll be so damn surprised. <laughs> Some sexy man comes out of your basement, just been down there all along. Oh my gosh. I mean, at the same time, that's probably pretty damn terrifying. That would be terrifying as hell. Jesus Christ. Alright. Dinari Amnes' basement. Gosh, we are still in combat with whatever the hell was on the other side of that, uh... That, this thing. Good lord. Let's make sure that there wasn't, like, a, a thing that we could maneuver and open using that. Let's see. Are there any? No? No? If there are one, if there is one, it ain't around here. It's, it's like on the other side, or hidden away somewhere. Gosh, what a damn puzzle. What a damn mess. Let's get the hell up out here, and hopefully she won't be mad as hell. Here, let's take off our shoes in case we need to do a sneak. There we go. Nice. Oh, we are actually detected by whatever the hell it is. Wow. Maybe it's a gigantic sewer dragon. All right, she's none the fucking wiser. Excellent. Let's see, should we steal some stuff here? Some root pulp? Calipers again? A bowl? Cowhide shoes? No thanks. Do you think she's in and around here? I don't fucking know, I'm a little scared. It's gotta be said, I'm a little damn scared. I mean, worst case scenario, we'll just go back inside and wait until night, and then do it when she's sleeping. There we go. Nice. Man, could you imagine that? Yeah. I'd be worried that, like, gobbles and stuff would come up out of your manhole cover. Right? In the middle of the night, you could just, like, wake up and find gobbles all over your fucking kitchen. Let's see. There we go. Nice! All right. Jeez. And I definitely wouldn't keep anything out out by the sewer, huh? Jeez. Who knows what kind of uh, ne'er-do-well could just come up there and just start stealing all of your corn. Gosh. We can pay another beggar with that. <laughs> Good lord. Alright. Well, it seems like we're A-OK -okay and safe. And look, we have to pick our way through this door, too. There we go. And... Nice. Dope. Please don't be in your kitchen! Please don't be there! Uh-oh. Oh! 
by the nine divines, can't a woman get a moment to herself? I'm sorry! Leave me! I'm sorry! I'm sorry! Jeez! <laughs> oh gosh, was she the other thief? Wait, was she the other thief? Was that her name? Wait, no, her name was Methrodel. She was just some other lady who looked kind of, uh... She was wearing leather armor, therefore she looked like a thief. Man, we're still in combat with whatever that was. Oh my good god. Alright, I've beaten Meridel. Let's see, do we have a wanted level when she saw us? Let's see, bounty? Zero! Alright, she was just upset uh, at us being there. Okay, Jesus Christ. Can we, like, fast travel and get out of this combat? As much as I appreciate the combat music, holy crap. Oh, great. Enemies are nearby! Some enemy is chasing me all over the damn place! <laughs> god! What the hell? This ain't good! It ain't good! Alright. Jesus, we're just running through the town being chased by some sort of Gabo Armada. Some, like, crouching tiger hidden Gabo. Jeez, I'm peaked. You know what? Hey, we were going to read that one book. Maybe we should instead read this journal that we looted, right? Oh, there we go. Finally, we're safe. Yeah, we'll read this, um, secret journal that we picked up instead. We'll get that done, huh? Good idea. Because, hey, you know what? We may never find it again. We may never come across it. It may have some sort of interesting clue for us that will hint to the future of the Thieves so. Guild, right? Oh my gosh. We'll read it before we uh, call it, and next time, next video, we come back, we'll actually turn in the damn quest, huh? Good plan. Great plan. I sure as shit think so. All right. Let's just head on over here past all of these beautiful looking boats. Oh, look, and there's a Nernroot over there. Look, we're going for a bit of a swim. We're going to wash all of the poop off of, off of us. Oh, my gosh. Beautiful. We just jump in there. We're covered in, like, a brown glaze. And as soon as we jump in, oh, it spreads everywhere. And we're just oh, dripping with know. clean water. And, oh, my gosh. It looks like you someone just took the greatest shit ever. The dark. Beautiful, isn't she? Oh, my God. The Maria Elena. Damn fine ship. With a damn fine crew. I should know. I'm her first mate. Malvulus is my name. Okay. So believe me when I tell you we don't like it when people snoop around in our affairs. You get near that ship and my men will run you through. Wow, okay. Jeez. Alright. So, have you bet on any arena matches lately? Wow, look at no, all these pirates no. and stuff. Have puny Ancus? He doesn't look that puny. Nothing I'd like to talk about. Alright. Jesus Safe. Christ. Well, let's read about this shit that we stole, huh? And uh, if you don't want to stick around for reading this diary, well, holy crap. Till next time. When next we come back, we're going to turn in the quest, continue on with the Thieves' Guild, get a fence going, and then, holy shit, we'll actually do the main quest. We'll actually go to Kavach. In between videos, I may actually get some enchanting going. We'll get a little bit of enchanting, because we're going to need that for uh, head to Kavach land. It's going to be a tough one. But luckily, uh, we have our ace in the hole, Scampy. And our new, uh, our new thing, our new, wh who's a what's it? Our, uh, our paralyzed staff. Oh my gosh, it's gonna be so good for when we, when we go to Kavach. Anyway, let's see. Whose journal is this again? Let's, let's, uh, Amantius Electus's diary. I've planted the seeds of the drinkers. Soon I shall know if my theories hold true. Oh my gosh, is this another Glarthier? The first shoots have appeared. I must make sure to continue the precise schedule of nutrient solutions. Oh. Small drinker fronds are clearly visible. This is a critical time in their development. I'm almost out of rat blood. <gasps> oh, shit. I'll have to catch some more of the filthy beggars. What? They were feeding beggar blood to their plants? Oh, no. The young plants are juveniles now. I can see them waving as if in a breeze. Although the air in my cellar is as still as death. Holy shit. I'm having a hard time catching any more cats. I may have to start using dogs. The damn drinker plants have a voracious appetite. One of them cut me today. I'll have to be more careful. My creations are refusing to feed. As an experiment, I offered a drop of my own blood, which one of them drank greedily. The other drinkers are beginning to wither. I collected a bucket of human blood from the healers. I had to pay an exorbitant amount to keep their to keep her tongue still. The drinkers are doing much better. 
Am I doing the right thing? The benefit of all of these plants to all of Cyrodiil is beyond doubt, but the price may be too high. What is the benefit? It is one of the most difficult decisions of my life. I have destroyed no my notes for how to hybridize drinkers. I set the trays on the roof where the sun could strike them. An hour after sunrise, they were all dead. They're vampire plants! What the fuck? These plants are half plant, half vampire, all 100% evil! My attempt to create a hybrid- <gasps> What?! Oh my god! Really?! Holy shit! My attempt to create a hybrid of vampire and plant has failed. They were just too dangerous. Two parts grave dust, one part ash salts, mixed with human blood, exposed to two hours of moonlight each night. Oh my god! Holy shit, they really were plant... plant pyres. Vamp... vamp plants. Vamp plants. Shit. All right. Jeez, what a weird little conspiracy theory we've uncovered. Or not even theory, but conspiracy. Jesus Christ. Well, when next we come back, we'll, uh, we'll be here ready to turn some shit in. And, uh, you know what? We'll also, maybe in between videos, we'll have a whole bunch of stuff ready to be enchanted or already enchanted. Who knows? Who knows? Till next time, peace! Peace!